What's up, y'all? It's Sierra Monet, aka Barbie Girl C, and I'm back again with another video. So, as you guys can tell by the title, I will be making my first wig on a sewing machine, and I'm super excited about it. So, these are a few of the items that I'm going to be using for today's video. Um, I'm using an extra large mesh dome cap, and I'm also using a size 23 wig head. Um, the wig head I got off of Amazon. And actually, I got everything off of Amazon, even the sewing machine. The sewing machine is a brother sewing machine. This was very easy to use for my first try. So, yeah, I would definitely recommend the sewing machine. Um, it wasn't hard. I just looked up a video on how to, you know, thread it and all of that. And it was pretty simple. So, I'm just pinning down my wig cap. And you want to make sure you stretch it so that way when I do the next part, everything will be straight and, you know, all cool and whatnot. So I'm just showing you guys how it looks all around. And now I'm just taking a white crayon. You can use a silver marker, white marker, whatever. I can only find a crayon. Kind of childish, whatever, but yeah. So I actually have forgot to outline my frontal before I started doing the back so I just backtrack you know whoa run it back real quick and you want to just pin down your frontal and you want to make sure that you pin down the sides going straight and you don't want it to curve or anything you just want it to be straight and you also want to leave your frontal hanging off of your wig cap just a tad bit because why would you make your wig like that so yeah <laughs> Okay, so as y'all can see, I took the frontal off and kept putting it back on. I probably did this about five times. I'm a per perfectionist, and it just wasn't perfect to me, so whatever. Um, I kept doing it. The best part about it is you haven't sewn anything down yet. It's just pins. You haven't cut anything. You haven't did anything. So you can literally take it off, put it back on as many times as you need to. Don't stress it. You'll get it right. I promise. <laughs> Okay, so once I finally got that frontal situation taken care of, all I'm doing is going in and drawing some white lines where I want to put my track set on my wig. Um, and you want to leave a little bit of space. I didn't leave as much space as I've seen some other people use in their YouTube videos, but I mean, it was my first wig and I was just trying it out. Honestly, I love how my wig came out, so I probably will do this spacing again. Um, there was nothing wrong with it. But yeah, you want to make sure your lines are as straight as possible. That's probably the main thing of this whole part. Get them straight lines, girl.
Okay, so when you have finished drawing your lines, this is what it should look like. Um, and yeah, I'm using hair for Modern Show Hair on AliExpress. If you guys want a review on the hair, let me know in the comments below and I'll be happy to do it for you guys. Right now, all I'm doing is doubling my weft on the sewing machine. And y'all, this was a little bit of a struggle. Like, oh my goodness. I haven't used a sewing machine since middle school. And we was making pillows and stuff. So, sewing these tracks together to double them up. Oh my god, I didn't think it would be this hard. But I feel like the more I do it, the more I'll get better at it. You know? Yeah, I'm saying... Okay, y'all, so this is what my double tracks look like. It's not perfect, but again, it's my first time, so don't try to drag me. Um, so now it's time to actually sew the wig on, sew the hair onto the wig cap. And basically, the main object of this is to not stretch the cap. Um, yeah, just don't stretch the cap. You want your lines to be straight and no wrinkles in it, but you don't want to pull on the cap while you're sewing because then maybe your wig won't fit. I don't know, y'all. Just wait until I get more knowledge of making a wig on a sewing machine and then it's lit. But yeah, I'm going to keep on making videos of how I make wigs on a sewing machine um, so that eventually I can give you guys an in-depth tutorial on how to make one. But I just wanted to make this video to kind of like track my progress and, you know, first wig type of thing on a sewing machine because, y'all, I'm about to be making so many wigs on a sewing machine like, like it's nobody's business. So, yeah, don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and whatever else you want to follow me on. I don't have anything else, but <laughs> yeah, make sure you subscribe and comment some video requests that you might have. Hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, give me a big like if I didn't say that already. And I'll see y'all in my next one. Deuces! Okay, y'all, so I know I said deuces, but I forgot that I don't know what happened to the clip of me doing the actual frontal sewing it on. Um, but basically, I just hand sewed the frontal on. Um, and yeah, it was pretty, pretty simple. Um, if you guys want to see how I customized this frontal and how I styled a wig, check the description box. I do have a video on that. So yeah, I'm really gone this time. Deuces!